Hey there, Sharon Hornell from here, but you can call me Pajama Grandma. In case we haven't met yet, go ahead and put hashtag pajama in the comments below. Then I know it's the first time you are being exposed to the Pajama Grandma. Today, I have a quick question. How often do you just choose not to participate? <clears throat> Sometimes, I find these days that it's better to just step aside and choose not to participate in certain activities or certain things. Say you've got drama going on in your family or drama going on at work or drama going on in your business. Sometimes it's better to just step back, observe the drama and decide to not participate because it's not in your best interest. It's not about you or, and a lot of times we get involved in other people's lives and discussions and problems and issues and we take them on as if they're our own and it's really not about us. It's totally about them. And all we do is complicate the issue and make it worse. In those situations, nowadays, I'm getting smarter and smarter as I get older. I choose not to participate. If a couple of other people are having an interpersonal challenge, it's none of my business. I choose not to participate. I certainly am not going to put myself in the middle of that situation. So next time, realize that you have the option to choose not to participate. So comment below, because I'm really curious if anybody else takes the same stance. Do you always offer advice? Do you always help? Do you always get involved? Or do you consciously choose not to participate sometimes? Go ahead, comment below, because I would love to know. Have a fantastic day. Pajama Grandma out.